Welcome to the Wednesday, October 23rd, 2013 edition of Erner Berry's Daily Video, sponsored by Moark Eggs. In today's video, cattle and hog futures rally. And later, we take a look at the pork, ham, turkey, drum, and thigh meat relationship. Now with news on Walmart's expanded free-range egg distribution partnership, here's your host, Jamie Chadwick. Walmart will broaden its distribution network of free-range eggs with an expanded partnership with California's The Happy Egg Company. The latest pack will send The Happy Egg Company's free-range eggs westward to Walmart stores in 10 states. Additionally, Walmart will be the first company to carry The Happy Egg Company's 10-pack container of free-range eggs. For more details about this story, along with other Center of the Plate protein news, check out foodmarket.com. In other news, cattle and hog futures rallied during yesterday's trading on the Chicago Mercantile Exchange. Here is Ernerberry Pork Market reporter Russell Barton with the latest. Cattle and hog futures rallied in yesterday's trading on the Chicago Mercantile Exchange. According to Scott A. Miller & Associates, the sharp cattle future increases were brought about on strong wholesale beef prices, technical buying and tighter cattle supply expectations for the weeks and months ahead. Additionally, feeder cattle rebounded on a spillover from live cattle and lower corn prices. Meanwhile, Erner Barry's Kurt Thacker said yesterday's gains in the futures market reversed a week-long downtrend as contracts closed at three and four day highs. As for hogs, Thacker reported higher hog futures lifted by an increase in wholesale pork prices and support from gains in the cattle complex. Speculative buying and short covering also added to the gains. Comtel customers can see more Erner Barry Newswires updates from the cattle and hog industries by clicking the news link under the red meat tab. Thanks, Russell. We wrap up today's show with Erner Barry's poultry market reporter, Terrence Wells, explaining demand patterns and its influence on the turkey thigh meat, drum, and pork ham markets. The further processing interactions shared between turkey thigh meat, turkey drums, and pork hams are well established ones. The present relationship is especially noteworthy if we focus our attention on the Mexican market and the current price duel between hams and drums. Demand for drums from all traditional buyers has been nothing short of spectacular. When combined with declines in the turkey slaughter, drum values have skyrocketed. They've risen above ham values, which, as anticipated, has already resulted in shifted demand patterns away from drums. If history holds true, recently lowered ham values will pressure drum prices until the relationship once again changes course and resumes the cycle. On the other hand, there's been no time in history like the present when domestic and export dark meat requirements have been at such super high levels. It's possible that this change in demand may also change the future direction of the drum, ham, and thigh meat relationship. But for now, we'll just have to wait and see. For more U.S. turkey news and market analysis, head over to Comtel and click on the poultry tab. Thanks, Terrence. That's it for today's video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. This broadcast is sponsored by Moark Eggs. For more than 50 years, Moark has grown their business with a commitment to adding real value to their products and services, providing old-fashioned customer service that is tested and proven to meet your needs. Visit them online at www.moarkllc.com or give them a call at 866-757-EGGS.